let m and be positive integers if x square plus mx plus 2n and x square plus 2nx plus m equal to 0 have real roots in the smallest possible value of m plus n have real roots so b square minus 4ac should be greater than or equal to 0 so m square minus 8n is greater than or equal to 0 2n the whole square minus 4m should be greater than or equal to 0 or 4n square minus 4m is greater than or equal to 0 n square minus m greater than or equal to 0 m square minus 8n greater than or equal to 0 lovely we have this after this does not do this algebraically it's a pain when m square is greater than or equal to 8n n square minus m greater than or equal to 0 from now on we want m plus n to be as small as possible you put in our positive integers you put n equal to 1 right then m square should be greater than or equal to 8 it should be 3 or more if you put n m as 3 then n should be 2 or more so 1 n equal to 1 does not work wonderful so if you put n equal to 1 it doesn't work because then both conditions cannot be satisfied put n equal to 2 n square is 4 4 minus m greater than or equal to 0 or m is 4 or lesser m square minus 8 into 2 greater than or equal to 0 m square minus 16 is greater than or equal to 0 m is 4 or more or m could be 4 n equal to 2 m equal to 4 works it just works the side becomes 0 that side becomes 0 both types the real roots are are equal but it works 2 plus 4 is 6 nothing else will work that much we know if we put n equal to 1 it doesn't work n equal to 2 m is 4 the best case scenario and it just works we can confidently mark this do not go about this algebraically plug in a few values see where it takes us